Hi, it's Chris Wong with another workout session. Uh, for this workout session, I didn't give myself enough time to work out, and I only had about 30 minutes to work out. So, as usual, I try to pick about three different uh, workouts to cover majority of the body. I decided to start off with uh, Arnold presses, and I started off with uh, 30 pounds just to warm up. Eventually, I worked up to 45 pounds. And then I did my final set with uh, 50 pounds. Now it will take me time to build up strength back to what I was doing at one point. I remember a couple years ago, I've done it with 50 pounds for about five reps. So I think uh, consistency is probably one of the most important things to maintain strength and to build strength. And that's one of the reasons why I just decided to do what I could for the workout and decided to try to uh, do the workout more often instead of uh, try to um, annihilate the muscles and then uh, let it recover for days and then do it a, a week later. I used to do it that way during uh, my uh, school years and then realized it was not the uh, most effective way for me to go on through my days when I'm not working out. I actually finished my workout with uh, Penley Rose and I was using the Supine grip kind of like a semi snatch grip and I was starting off with 155 pounds and I did find the uh, supinated grip was actually harder than the uh, pronated grip and then I started working with uh, a deficit because I did find if I was going to uh, do a lot of deficit deadlifts of any variation, I might as well get used to doing penalty rows from uh, standing on a deficit. And I did find it challenging and I did find it activated my hamstrings more when I got into position. So I still um, cheat on my lifts when I uh, do penley rows because I did find if I'm using my uh, hips or if, uh, or even a little bit lower back if I am, at least uh, um, I'm conditioning my body for like part of the movement of a deadlift and trying to condition myself to handle cheat lifts in case uh, like I make mistakes while going strict all the time. And I did feel like the muscles were getting worked out, even though not all the work was done by my upper back. So when I actually finished this workout, I actually realized I ran out of time to train my uh, lower body with a squats or glute work.